absolute beauty. The old stinger, he had to do it to me. That is a really good roll. Are you kidding me? Did that actually just happen? What is up y'all? Hope y'all having a wonderful day. We are here at the beautiful International in Bolton, Massachusetts. This is the location for the next live event that's gonna be played beginning of September. This place is immaculate. There's gonna be a one V one match, me against Matt on the back nine. First hole of the match, number 10, par four. 445 yards, bunkers down the right. Down the left side, he needs a hop right. I don't know. Yep, uh, that's why he does this for a living. Not a preferred lie. 170 to go, and uh, just hoping to kind of punch it up to the front. Kind of get me up and down, see what we can do. It is like right over there. Primo position, and you just do not have a bad lie in these perfect fairways. 115 left. Let's stick one in there close. Let's see if we can't get an early one up lead on that. That was a little chunky right there. That was a little chunky. You think? So I did not hit mine the most solid, but we did reach the very front edge. We've got Matt here, just a little short. Settle. All right, he's got a puff for par. I paced it too hard. Oh, that was a good roll. That was fancy. And has continued. That was huge. The putter has really felt good here. These greens are so good. That's a good putt. Thank you. With that par putt there, I do take the early one up lead. We're on to number 11, our second hole. This is a really good par three. Pin set left, 161 flag. So the wind just shifted, and now it feels like it's downwind, so I'm gonna go with a little nine. <clears throat> it's really into the wind, he has no idea. It is putting, a little right. Got a little eight iron action for you guys. Come on, go. Go. Go hard. Boy, Zach, this, uh, all this golf we're playing is uh, showing. I am a little short of pin high, landed right there, spun to the right. There is a huge ridge here, so I just needed that a little left, and it would have trundled to the hole. I've got about 35, 40 feet here. That was not played too bad. Go in. Are you? Oh, what a chip. Great chip, sir. Don't ask me to hit an eight iron, but I'll chip it for you. That was going right. Open the door. That's good. All right, never mind. You can make it too. That's a really good up and down. Thank you. 
because mine was not an easy two putt and that chip was phenomenal. I just like to make things more difficult than they need to be. So we each make a bogey early, matches level through two. We're onto a very cool par five, number 12. 556, spins around to the left. Just kind of want to keep it left of those right fairway bunkers. Heading down the right side, needs to hang on. All right, it hop left. I think it's in the fairway. Yeah, he's right next to me, I think. Maybe past me, actually. No, right next to me. 255, hole, uh, into the wind. So just gonna try and keep it just a little right of the TV tower and try to get it up and down. 265's three wood, so I could, but it looks like you're dead if you're like anywhere past the pin. Doesn't seem worth it. Oh, I chunked it. It'll Live. probably still be in the fairway down there. It's a good layup. 249 here. I've got three iron, kind of in the same situation as Matt. Four wood is a little too much. I'm gonna try to keep this right at that bunker maybe creep on that front right otherwise just have a decent little chip across the green uh, if it goes could be good i don't think it had go juice though all right matt coming from the fairway 65 yards oh that could be nice all right Got a puff for bird. We are just absolutely doing this at the same way possible, but I'm gonna make my putt. Wow, you almost had it. Oh. All right. All square through three. That's right. Par threes out here are really good. I think the team that has the best chance of winning is the team who scores the best on these par threes. There's five par threes out here, and this is a really cool one. Down the hill, number 13, 126, playing downhill about 13. So playing down to about 113 with the helping breeze. So probably playing right now about 105. All the way back, there is a back box that they might be playing. They probably will be playing that's about maybe 25 yards further. So most guys be hitting wedges here either way. But these par threes are really pretty special here at the International. So we're both going to be going with sand wedge here. Does he like it? Go a little bit. Oh, I missed it. Baby. Thanks. Oh, nuts. That's what we're looking for right there. You love to see it. Well, when you're hitting them into the stratosphere, down to the par threes, make sure you work the divot in, not up. Keep the roots in the ground. Right, Zach? Yes, sir. And always fix your pitch marks. Nice. Just like that. Can't even tell. Needs to trundle. That might go. Oof. That went back to the right. I didn't see it going back to the right. Ah, uh, I'll give that to you. It's fine. Oh, thought Good we pick. had one. Oh. Hit it through the break. Didn't leave it short. You are one down, sir. Yes, I am. Par five, number 14, bends around to the right. Definitely reachable if you hit a good tee ball. Our aiming point's gonna be kind of right down the middle with a little fade, because this hole does bend to the right. 531 yards, tee it high, let it fly. Well, 
that was tattooed. Driver's feeling pretty good. Just got to get everything else on point. Ooh, that was a bullet. That one should play well as well. So Matt got me right there. He hit a low screamer. Got me by about 15 or 20. I have 225 left. So Matt's got about 205. It's into the wind. We're going four iron. that yesterday too when we played here i just hit a not good long iron all right we got matt here he did not have a good lie hit it Ooh. That was a good shot. I've had enough. You conceding me the pin slammer? Yeah, dude. With Matt conceding the birdie putt there, that gets me two up in the match, four to play. Still a lot of golf and anyone's match. We're on a number 15, super cool par four, 427. This place pretty straight, but there is bunkering up there right and left. You want to be left of the right bunker, but short of the left bunker. So this isn't really a driver hole. I'm probably going three iron and Matt has an iron as well. To the moon. Should be good though. The old stinger. He had to do it to me. He did. No club twirl. Good shape right here. 169 left. Pretty good angle into the green here. And then Matt is maybe four or five yards closer on his angle. I went with an eight iron and did not hit it well. Matt's got an eight iron here as well. Heading out right. Needs to draw. Oh, Ooh, man. There might be a little wind up there. I thought it was behind us. Yep. Needs to go, get up there. Oh no, oh no. That was like one hop away from perfect. Go. Needed just a little more trundle on that one. Oh, nope. cool. only a couple feet by. That one's good. That one's good for both. Not our best show on the approach game right there. Both made bogey. I remain two up with three to play. And as you can see right behind, they are setting up for the live event. This is gonna be quite the view from the birdie tent there, looking out over that view. Absolutely incredible. We're on number 16, par four. Dog leg to the left, 432, and we are gonna be trying to cut that corner right there, kind of taking it up through that V with the draw. Well, that's about perfect. Should be good. Ooh, that was hit well. It started on a great line, but did fade a little bit. Probably just gonna be right rough. Right. Matt here, right rough. I'm over there in the fairway. Both roughly 65 yards left, going with lob wedge. Let's see if one of us can't stay it close. Get a little bounce back bird. Pretty sweet stand for the grands. 
Well, yeah, that made sense. Stand for the grands. I'm here for you, yes, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Pretty cool grandstands for the fans. I thought I about landed that perfect. Oh, that was a nice chip. You better give me that. <laughs> wow, he's <laughs> asking for putts late in the match. That was pretty good. We'll give that to you. It's only about a foot and a half. Travel! I guess you didn't want to win that bad. Apparently not. That's good. So Matt is dormy. I'm two up with two to play. Par three, 17, 188. Little help and breeze. I'm gonna go with the seven iron here. Cool little waste bunker all down the left side. So would love to go ahead and close Matt out right here. Let's see if we can do it. Bet you would. Short right. Oh, I tugged it. Had a little left. All right, kind of front left corner. I mean, that's pretty good. That about forces you to make it. About. That is a really good roll. Are you kidding me? Did that actually just happen to send it to the final hole? Dude, I gotta give it to you. That's one of the best putts I've seen in a minute. No, actually, there's another one. I was not expecting that. <laughs> Great putt. By the way, it definitely broke way more than a cup and a half. Matt was asking me how much I thought it broke and he didn't listen to me. For However, good reason. <laughs> pin slammer. There you go. <laughs> Dude, good putt. That was awesome. Well, sir, that just made things very interesting. And there was a little lull in the match, and that just turned things around in a hurry. That new flat stick's doing some good stuff. 554. You just kind of want to keep it left of that right bunker you see there. So kind of aiming at those two bunkers there on the left. Heading down the right side. Fading. Absolute beauty. So Matt here, he's got a little hole there. If he chooses to do the stinger through it, I don't know. He's got 208. And mine is right back there, probably about 10, 12 yards further back on the angle. I do want to make sure I get it up there on that back shelf. So I'm going to go with a three iron here, put a little pressure on Matt. If I could knock this close, I'm not going to say it's over, but it would force him to make eagle. That was a smart play. Go! Door is open. Well, that was pretty good. Very nice. Back-to-back -back pin slammers. That's pretty impressive, sir. Finish great, strong. Great chip. Finish strong. Make the putt. Did he do it? Did he do it? Hoo -hoo. Well, I didn't leave it short. We're on a chip off. That is some really good playing there to finish it. I, f I had a turkey sandwich with four holes to go. I think I found some there. <laughs> We're going right here. And this is all sloping away. Matt's going first. Closest to wins all the marbles. Man, I think I was like a foot from being awesome. 
That's not bad. No. Did he make it? Did he make it? Oh. <laughs> That's closer. Dude, I thought I actually made that for a second. The way this trip is going, I wouldn't be surprised. <laughs> <laughs> So that one is Matt's and that one is mine. I am a foot or two closer. I want to thank the International again so much for having us out. This place is immaculate. As for me, Matt, the International. We'll see you when we see you. Peace.